All right, let's go. We restarted. We can start for our first round. Hmm. Nordic going for the one. Guess got smart on our twelve. Oh, welcome back. Okay, can you hear? Yes. Okay. Got we're just about to launch. Is it live? Yes. Ooh. Okay, hmm. start start soon. Yeah, they've just restarted, so yep, they're going. And I cannot see who is attacking. That's just nice. Good game. I go in the first person. Yeah, I can't. So you can see it. Oh, it seems, yeah, that the Antwant are starting with attacking. Or no. Mm -hmm. They're not. Central Pause is starting with attacking. Uh, yes, press into H. Need to restart with a restart and taunt command. More game. Mm, so it seems actually Nordic already got put on a halt, like they're stuck in no man's land. Can't really advance. Oh, one player going for the hill. Then it's Mad is going with MP18. MP18? Are they playing with double recon? No, uh, the oh, Antant oh. is, but then Center Powers has one gas squad. Just for the MP18, I guess, oh. and the Nades Mart 2. Which can be very useful. But then they get cleared out really fast. The Nordic team actually wants got getting in the left finger, so they can try to start pushing onto the trench. But the Slavs already knowing and it <laughs> gets cleared out. <laughs> Foothold, yep. It's pretty fast. Seems this will be a very hard game actually for Nordic. Very odd game. Are they even eight players? Yes, they have eight for eight. Eight players, okay. Yes. Those, uh, eight versus eight. That's yeah, there we nice. go. Oh, and they got uh, in on the right, on the hill now. It's a good place to hold, especially without mortar. Hard to get pushed mm -hmm. out of if you're aware of your surroundings. Yeah, it's like. <laughs> slow, but Kanistan is going huge on the hill. They just wipe. Oh, yeah. there's one guy is coming there. from one behind. There. He misses. <laughs> It misses. It, oh, what, what, was what was that lag? What was that lag? Great M two H, and they get taken out. I think like they have yeah, a foothold like and the left finger. Oh yeah, they're still in there. Yep, twenty second. They have a little foothold. Uh... <laughs> the Finnish already swearing, and cursing themselves. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I mean it's a difficult situation right now. Yes, the, like good defense from the. Wolfer is leading, is leading the server with 8 uh, nil yeah. as KD. Is he sniping somewhere? I think, yeah, definitely is sniping. Let me check. Wolfer, yeah, he's playing with the MLEs, but like... Just good, choice. The good choice, good choice for him, and they keep guarding the finger. He got a really good place. Yes, What? watch out, there's a prone in front of him. Oh, oh and he got, and he got Somehow him. misses him though, and they can start attacking. And he got, now they can attack. And one the whoa, no, I was one deserter in the end oh, in the trench. Raid and wipe out the deserters, and not a game yeah. really to defend right now. Yeah. Since Madis is doing nil four, Matthias the Wormog nil six. Not a great lineup for Nordic team, but not really. No, it's like they have a completely different team almost than last year. Mm. I would lacking, say they... they're lacking a few key players of last year. Yes, yeah, they're not like the ultimate favorites. Yeah, right now, right now, Slow Balkanis have a nice foothold on the left side with two guys there. Yeah, and we got the yeah, uh, pushed the by no. Oh, now they get in on the left too. They can like I was just Both start pushing it. Try to scrub it there. They can just like that. close it in. But always watch out at the right side because Slow Balkanis time is pushing hard there and the, from the Norman's land. Wolf are still holding on from the foothold. Yep. They were really, still really holding. Long. Yep. Still holding the. 13 0 for him. <laughs> He's really, really important now. And. Yes, going yeah, in and out. 
just pushing him one by one, so he can, as long as he's first, he can kill them. Oh, he missed miss twice. <laughs> gets the stab. Oh, and he, got, and he got the stab on smiley face. Great, like, unfortunately, great play for him. He's unable to give spawn on his squad, so they have to yeah. keep off running over. Oh, uh, right now, now Dick is pushing guard. Oh, from I think not. But he got some backup from their teammates. And, yep. Yeah, right now they're more they're more on the right side and one middle running towards the trench. And it got gunned out Raiden by his smiley face. Oh Wolfer Wolfer's Oh, oh first death for Wolfer. First death for Wolfer. Going and forty Nordic, to one. It's insane. Nordic <laughs> team right now is trying to spread out to fill out the well, they pushed they everyone out pretty much, so that's really oh, good. Nice oh, nice outplay well, bomb for sorry. Raiden. Yeah, Nordic Dam. Bit they passive. A hard time. A bit passive. Same this. as the last, like last year they were like maybe one of the easier teams, mm. worst teams. This year they have like a really strong lineup. So far in the Nordic Dam, Pema is leading with 12-4. Yep. He's like the only player that has 10 kills so far in that team. Mm -hmm. Smiley right thinks with 9 kills. Right now, Slowball Canister is going to take the trench. 3 4 cap. Great yeah. foothold on the left side, considering the Nordic position. As long as they have more players in, like, yeah, for now they will. Yeah, they and they got it. And that they got it. It's really hard for the Nordics to take this trench back. Mm hmm. Yeah. Although there is a really small no man's land, so like you can get in the trench pretty fast yeah, with a slow yes. with a timer Especially on out. the right side and they just respawn there, so they can have right now a good foothold. Yeah, because when you have like these two big creators just like being the no man's land they can mm -hmm. there's many ways to like enter the trench. Yes, right now slow Balkanistan is a, a bit crowded on the left side. One out playing bomb and we kill uh, at least yeah. two guys of them. Oh, and respawn. Respawn. respawn was kind of... Well, Team Nordic is a bit afraid of entering the trench. They yeah, they're, they're like really passively. Pretty passively. Yeah. But right now, yeah, well, they still have a foothold, nice foothold on the right side. Yeah. There's uh, only one player from Slow Balkanistan tries to push them from the middle, but not really effective enough. And yeah, well, this spawn, spawn the middle, Slow Balkanistan. The mid spawn is nice because you can just mid like push spawn. out, make sure nobody's. You can just push out to the edges of the trench, clearing it out. Yeah. Yeah. The. Oh, whoa. Now only two players. Whoa, great. Big one squad respawned to the left while Nordic team kept that foothold. But they, they got gunned down easily. Raiden took him down. And yep. Matthias going for the look or just like to make yep. sure that if he misses, he can meet <laughs> Yes. Uh, another left. Left respawn while Nordic team kept the trench back. They kept the trench back, yeah, very good to them. Very nice. But just the warm up got gunned down by the wall of Slow Volcanistan team. And now they're pushing, pushing to the middle from the left. Yep. Yeah, and don't, yeah, don't pushing. They get almost control of the entire trench, just like this one dude here mm. in the middle. Right now, Nordic team has the Big real fights. advantage. They, yeah. they have. Uh, any Big spawn alive. by the Nordics who can now push over to the other side, and it's yep. now just the Slavs who need to hold on to that small edge. Slavs still at the respawn on the hill right side, while the others are still camping a bit in the left to keep in the foothold. Rather oh. strange place to put the gas, in my opinion. Yeah, so what... <laughs> oh. I have no just... idea what the purpose was of that. Oh. Like, hey, Pooh, what are you doing there? <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, just but in the I middle. Think it was a misclick, probably. Yeah, maybe. But still, uh, right now it covers the wall left and 
guys from the Nordic team can't see, re can't really see the, the left part of the trench, but nothing really important because the Slovak yeah, like there's there's no spawns the... tonight or anything. Like you can still push. In yeah, from Slovak right. can is some pushing guard on the right side. We have pawns. Whoa, pawns Big got a spawn double there. there. The Slavs. Yeah. Yep. Now they can like push in the trench and start clearing it out again. Almost half them in the trench. Oh, Raven got a few kills. The Entente are really in an advantage considering the gas yep. mask. Just yes, and have a so look. There's still, there's still a left foothold for the Slavoboy Kanistan, far left corner. And far Big left spawn. Oh, like eight guys spawn in there, I think. Uh, yeah. Can restart. They lost oh, the and they got it. Slovak and England got this, their second trench in this match. While well, Nordic team still struggling to push him them back. Yeah. And keep the attacking phase on the other side of the map. They are trying, but they are yes, just not. I think not focused enough. At the moment, yes, it's doing. Like what they Something want. Something not working really. Pemo is uh, in the MP18 squad, but he's not really using the MP18. Yeah, his... nobody's using MP18. Although he swapped spots with Mardis, so maybe we'll take it later. At the moment, he's leading, he's leading the server with 26 hate, but uh, it's not really enough yeah. to art carry the Nordic team so far. Nice foothold. On the right side, by the Nordic team. Yes. They have it. While the left uh, is still pretty much guarded by slow by yeah. Oh, use uh, left spawn Small in the... spawn in the, for yeah. the Nordics on the left. Maybe yeah, while, to push. while the slow by Kanistan crowd that, gets noticed that made up the trench. Like, their spawn just get more down. And they're holding, yeah. They, they keep holding. Well, Nordic is doing pretty well there on the left side of them, holding that foothold. At this point, the Slovo Kanistan is playing very smart. They will look in the middle, they're trying yeah. to play the flank, little flanks around. And they try to, to wipe the right, res the right respawn for the Nordic team. And there we go. He got gunned down a right respawn for the Nordic team. Scrublet did it. Nordic can recapture now at the moment. Yeah, they have the majority in. And one squad respawned left. He may get two kills on the spawns, so that's important, but then eventually gets killed. He may pretty nice triple there, guarding. Smiley face get the last one in their entire yep. Slavic team is dead. And now. yep, they recapture it. Team All team wiped. That, that team. was a good counter attack. Yep, definitely. Finally, they it seems they found, the, they found the groove back in. It is working out. Yeah, now the uh, team's level by Kanistan is splitting a bit up. Yeah. This is Some kind of an annoying, it is an annoying yeah. moment slant to cross because you're running uphill with lots of open ground to get shot from. Yes, yeah, also take care this. because uh, Nordic team had enough time to spread out their trench and uh, yeah. keep the defending position. Exactly, yeah. Now it's just point of using those planes. Oh, nice Good. raid and outplay bomb for Nordic <laughs> made this. <laughs> like that's very important. Those few, if you, you don't have nades, so those airplane bombs are really important. Yeah. To get those annoying players in annoying corners. Pemo still leading the server. 11 for him. <laughs> While the second so far is. Uh... It's a smiley face, I think, also. 20 yep. 20. He died 20 times already, so like many yeah. of the Nordic players have died 20 times or more. Mm -hmm. Only two have died so many times in the Anton side, Slavic side. And Slav seems like controlling the, the trench. Oh, big, big left respawn for the Nordic. Yeah. They can actually flank the Slavs. They're completely oblivious. Oh, not really, not yeah, really. Yeah, the sloughs, are, the sloughs are holding on really nice. Get actually recapturing the trench now. Yep. More than halfway through. Yeah. Right now, the, the both teams are split it up and uh, keep a conservative position to pick down from the middle corridor. Oh. 
I think oh. the, the, the thing is what bot, what been playing in the bot teams is the hit registration, like Troll just said. Like the yeah. stabbing and the shots are like just not registering all the time. Which makes yes, sense. right now I'm not spectating the first person views, but I guess all the shots are really close uh, or missed yeah, for like, one millimeter. Yeah, like there is no sniper, so every shot has been fired in those, in like between zero and uh, like two meters. Mm -hmm. If shot misses for some reason, it's really strange. Should not happen. Slavs trying to make a like, little push in the middle and they succeed. Pawns knock down him, but he, they get him on the, right, on the right side. After he got knocked down by Matthias the Wormogger, oh, as picked from the Nomen's oof. Land. Oof. <laughs> yeah, definitely. <laughs> He got outsmarted there. <laughs> Zlav still kept pushing on the left side. Oh, their their foot all got wiped by Troll. Very nice pick there. Good push by him. The Slavs are like staying in front of the bridge, but like getting a hard time. It seems in getting inside really. As far as I can see, the Slavs' uh, main tactic is. Guard with the wall team so far. Yeah, yeah. If there's like oh, oh. fortunately they run out of time. Like right. they're waiting for their entire team to respawn before pushing, not going in one by one. It takes more time, but it is Yeah, considering that more that they respawn also in no man's land. Yeah. Sure. They need to hurry up to set up the defenses. Well Nordic struggle a bit to cross no man's land well. Wolfer, bit of annoying smiley face there in the left side. And yeah, now they're a bit of crowded. Just in front of the finger. And you squad respawn left for the Nordic. Yeah. They and are the both they are taking now on both sides, like one squad going left, one squad going right. You see one side is completely open, so one they got they are in the hill now the Nordics. I just want to point the fact that Raiden got the second airplane bomb kills again on <laughs> television. Yeah, he's putting he's putting his airplanes really really well. Yeah. Making uh, sure he gets those few kills. The same thing we can't say about the gas, which is put it just in the middle of the map. Again? In the of the trench. <laughs> yeah. That's that's a strange place to put it. Yes, I would have put in the middle uh, where oh, the re the respawn is there. Yeah, put yeah. it on the. They just put it on the wrong side for trench. I mean, maybe it's used as. They can use it as a cover to push in yeah. from the left. To f yeah, the I'm thinking there. that many players from the Slavs are left uh, sided. And yep, Nordic team got the control of the hill. Yeah. And the right. Oh, but there's a well, big spawn uh, there, so they may yeah, be exactly. able to push them out. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, he may, but he knocked them with the knife. Let's see if they can hold it. Saros pushing guard, and he got him. Gets, yeah. yeah. And they respawn. They completely and got wiped there. Just restart all over mm -hmm. in the trench. Oh, nice, nice job by Pemo. Yeah, nice Pemo got there. in the trench. Oh, but gets oh, taken out from no, further yeah. away. Unfortunate there. Leading still the server, 42 and 14. While the other side, the Slavs, uh, is still yeah, Wolf with Yeah, 33. 33 and 20, nice play by him. The Slavs a bit crowded in the finger, but right now they're spreading out. Raiden is going negative KD too, like that's surprising me. Negative KD? 20, 27 oh. times. It's not something you see a lot. But still, still doing a great job uh, in yeah. terms of uh, flanking and... Yeah, that's, that's the, the thing, like he's players. trying to flank and being really, really aggressive. Yeah. He dies a lot, but he gets those important picks. Also. Oh, the situation got a bit more static right now, since not a game had to respawn their players. And yeah, one and three seconds, so they have the one player in. Ma Matthias is in, but he's pushing, which he should not do. It's risky. 
It gets taken out, yeah. Oh, well, again, the pro owners. again, again, I will put that again. And there we go. Slavs pushing guard from the hill, but they don't care a lot about the two deserters on the right side of the map. Yeah. On the hill. Yeah. Two deserters on the hill, like. Yeah, they're kind of annoying, but yeah. Slavs didn't get them much. They're so many kills. So they can get that oh. off the hop. They're getting, they are getting good kills there. Making sure the Slavs cannot get in the trench. Nope. Nice the, de nice defend for the Nordic team. Ima Hippari knocked kills on trying to get in, to provide a foothold. <laughs> <laughs> and again with the toxicity of the Nordics. <laughs> So that was so <laughs> crowded there, and they actually got a. F no, it wiped out. Wiped out by Matthias the Warmog with a pistol prone. I heard you always you the, the best pistol camper here around. I oh, am. Yeah. <laughs> I still am. Um, especially on um, <laughs> Nobody can beat me on that map. <laughs> it's insane. Yes. Yeah, My favorite blue. map. Little push for this Slavs in the right, and they actually yeah. got a, a nice foothold there. Controlling yeah, the right side, and watch out, well. watch out. A nice pincer maneuver for them, because they just and got, they got the pushed left side. The trench. And they got spawn killed a lot right now. Not the team got yeah, spawn killed. This but Pemo, is, Pemo no is trying, is trying on right now. He's trying because on and he got, and he got him. Nice triple for him. He wiped out the respawn. Great up players. 51 and 16 for him right now. <laughs> He's doing really well, yeah. yeah. Next is only Gripson and uh, Wolfer with 37 kills both. Yep. That's like a really big difference, almost 20 kills difference. Yeah, exactly. Well, not really 20, but <laughs> it's almost 10. But... Oh, and another time the gas got put in the middle of the trench. Not really, but in the left corner. <laughs> it, it's kind of a strange, to be frank. Yeah, like, even it, either it's a tactic of doing or it's like just really unlucky with positioning of the gas. Yeah, it's also... Uh, the the most strange thing is that uh, Nordic team isn't using really a double recon tactic while they're using one gas and one... Yeah but, yeah, but then also Pemo, the, normally the reason why you pick the gas squad is for the MP18. Yes, and, and they're not, using not even it. using. Yeah. Oh. Uh, well, at this point, Slavs are struggling a bit to gain a foothold also in the middle because Hime is really guarding that, letting nobody in. Yeah, they're, 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 they're defending pretty well. Yeah, right now at this Spread. point, yeah. Spread out evenly. Yeah, they are yep. run out of time, unfortunately. We'll see if the Slavs will also use one of the deserters to get oh. those annoying kills. Still one deserting in the middle yeah, of the map. The, in the front of hill, but see, Oh, I got gunned out easily, easily by a wall Easily. Easy, easy. And yes, uh, right now Nordic team is pushing out the left side. Two guys going for the hill. No, uh, but one, one got knocked fox. down. He does not have the attack order next to him, so he can't even spawn his allies with him. Yes, yeah, so and one on the other, but as we look, like a maneuver, got, yeah. Goof got him. Madis doesn't He's have the bayonet, so like in a close quarter, really, is yes. lost anyway. Kind of a win fair, but yeah, what you gonna do? Then they can start over. The mm -hmm. scriplet now pushing on the hill. He might probably <laughs> hit by the pistol. <laughs> might probably set up the gas in another spot or is still on the finger. I don't know. Now we put it in a, like that spawn, like somewhere on the on the right. Oh, right now, right now they can push. They can push really hard because of the left side, right side is pretty open. It's just oh, oh, oh but this have a look. Now this have a look. One guy. 
One guy's oh no, he is reconnecting. One guy was oh. was missing in the his loves. I got seconds back. Seconds I got back. Thirty seconds left. Let's have a look. Oh. Yep. Web. Rookie well, and Rek Jaburek web the right respawn there. Yeah, like unfortunately the Nordic couldn't get make yep. use of the the seven v eight there for a second. Yeah, but still, uh, it's a nice tie, I would say. Yeah, they really, really well. 2-2. Two, two. They did um, a really good job. Slovak Kansa did really, really well at the in beginning. The beginning yeah. I was expecting Nordic. them to, to cap even the first, the second trench. To... And then the Nordic just like got their shit together, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> started playing more serious. <laughs> yes, and Let's have a look at the scoreboard, but uh, yeah, <laughs> Pemoy is uh, leading still 57 with kills. 57 and 17. Great job, also, died, also died fewest times. Yeah. <laughs> That's Over his play style. It's, it's good, I guess. A uh, nice balanced match. Yeah, let's really if, they, if they use the double recon squad or... They, I they, think they so. swapped in, in the end of the... Last game is up to the Barik and I think just to prepare themselves already for the next, for this round. <laughs> break? Nah. <laughs> Slavics don't want to break. <laughs> oh no. Nobody <laughs> wants to break. To decide if I... <laughs> Annoying if only one team wants to break and the other not. But still, the squad hasn't been switched, so yeah, they I will think it's not another wide. restart. Still not live. I was going the stream. Uh, did someone leave the comment? No, oh, yes, there is a stream. <laughs> Restart. It seems they are having a break. <laughs> I think that's the problem with the Nordics. Like I've, I went on the Discord and like many are just drinking alcohol at the <laughs> moment. <laughs> they are not <laughs> prepared to, to play serious now. Like at least half their team is just drunk behind their desks. Okay, so sounds like we're going live right now. Pemo switched for the NCO role, and yep. yeah, they seems like they switched a bit the scores. TV guy playing the sniper and throwing the the most aggressive role in the region yeah. squad. While the Slavs uh, changed nothing. With seems mad. This is job this time will be to provide the spawn, same as. Scripted. Still haven't understood why, why the Germans are all going to the right side. Just one, just one to the left, but uh, the Germans are attacking. Yes. They're starting what? with them. What is it? <laughs> I told, I told, always told that the time should have attacked first, but... Yeah, yeah. but I, I don't think they really care at the moment. Yes, most likely. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see how things are going. So, Nordic team pretty much spread out. Nobody on the hill to guard it, but it's not really important at this Kof point. Kof is the closest guy, but shoots the barbed wire, unfortunately, a couple of times. And then there's five at the right side, so... Let's see if the Slavs can push into the hill. Yep. Good outplay yeah. bump again by, by Zaros now. Yep. Clearing the hillside. Making sure they get en can enter there. Yes, they keep doing with the same tactics. Pushing on, on the same spot. Yeah. And they're, and they're doing great. And it pays off because they have the numerical advantage. So they can just like keep pushing guys in there. And yeah. their entire team is now on one side. 
to the guy trying to hold in the corridor, but at this point, there's two guys pushing him. Oh, and not two, three. <laughs> oh, oh he missed. He missed. Most unfortunate, but nice double kill there on the corridor. Yeah. Really, like, at least he gets like many of them. Because one squad oh. can just always start back pushing over the no man's lens. Yeah, we're now the split it. As before, as we have seen before, the one squad just, to the left yeah. and one other to the right. The trench is just split in half. Yep. Both sides controlling one side. <laughs> nice trash talking in the chat there. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice, like, at, at least half those play. Oh, one, again, one of them left. Matt just left, so it's a 7v8. Yep, 7v8 right now. It's unfortunate for the Nordics. Yeah, still... Let's have a look at the leading guys. Well, as far as Pemo I know, 8-0, incredible. And then oh. Perklevision. Perklevision, 6-2. Doing a great job the... holding. But right now, Slavs are pushing guard. Pushing guard yeah. the finger. And yeah, one and eight. still and holding back behind the trench and getting those skills from... Over the normal yep. Still one nine zero nine nil for him. And now it's really seven versus eight. It's like you saw again with the Belgian game yesterday. Like yep. as soon as you lose one play, like it will be really really hard to. Actually, at some point it was even six versus eight, yeah, but exactly. it was uh, at the at the end. Unfortunate. Yeah. But so far the Nordics are holding pretty well, like just the finger, then the right finger that's got yeah, so crowded it, by Slavs. It's even difficult at this point to flank them, because uh, three rivals are guarding the all the trench and they can't do anything about flanking. And Pune's getting those, this important spawn inside the trench so they don't have to run over, get picked off. You can just yep. start pushing again. And the Slav squad. They have finally dying. <laughs> After 12 kills, though. <laughs> and on the other side, keeps on doing a good job, 10 7. Yeah. Keeping, keeping the foothold. And right now, Slavs are pushing hard. They won that trench. They won really hard. Yeah. Because they know they have the advantage. Yeah. So they, can, they can just push in now. Big respawn right for the Nordic. And yep, right now Slavs controls the majority yeah, of the, yeah. the world Xaros range. is pushing there as the first player. Oh, it's, it's, gets one kill. Seems like nodding as a backup uh, SKR joined yeah. in. It's good. So, I always have a, I always have a backup ready. So let's hope it's on time. They still have twenty minutes. so should be fine to push in. Mm -hmm. Yep. They just lost the trench, unfortunately. Slavs took the trench. Let's see and if they can recover. Even though these labs are doing a passive job right now, but they still got the trench. Uh, can you see the, the scoreboard? Most of the players have a negative KD. Yeah, but still but they, have got, they got the they trench. Got the, and they got the advantage. They had like 78, so they, they don't have to yeah. kill. To, to capture the trench. Exactly. <laughs> no, yeah. Also, as far as I see, they're, they're communicating pretty well, the Slavs. Yeah, yeah they're, they're doing real. They have also a couple of trainings before the yeah. ENC just to make sure that they are on the same page. Oh, nice high prime bomb by Pemo on Raiden. Outplayed. And. Now Nordic's Nordic. got the on one side, capturing slowly. All the free life for the Nordic team, all in the trench. Oh, nice respawn there. All in the trench, there we go. One pushing on the hill, and the others watching the corridor. Yeah. Oh, seems like... Seems like Raiden... Oxalus. Raiden, yeah, there we go, Raiden got him. Raiden going on top of the hill. But he got Raiden knocked down by his and yes, right now the, uh, yes, the corridor is the old point. It's 
Strauss desperately holding onto the trench. Kodo is the odd spot here. And seems like Slavs have the advantage over them. Yeah. So yep. they are almost pushed out completely. Yep, and yeah, they have to do that again. Oh, in the meanwhile, an, a group of guys from the Nordic yeah, team... on the other side. A group of guys on the Nordic team, I have a foothold on the other side of the map. Yeah. And big mid push for the Nordic. Got him. And now they're watching the corridor. Ah, uh, Raiden Gun, the SKR. trying to flank, but gets out played by Spawn, unfortunately. Pemos, not anymore with the most kill, while well, Kurbson doing 1911 right now. Stole the first place yeah. here to Pemo. But still, Pemo has 17 and 6 right now. Got out gunned by Xarus. Gibson is also the our newest GKD member. Yep, Just that's true. In today. Nice. The little Benis. <laughs> we, we are growing once more. <laughs> Just like the number two. Except <laughs> everyone. <laughs> At least we accept only the decent players. Yes. We have like they respawn for the Nordic and now they're pushing yeah. out. Just like the Slavs. Oh, oh Slavs got time out. Can time out. Now they need to run back Very again. Mission, unfortunately. Many, many deserters by, for the, by the Nordics, though. Yes, well. well but on the, Slavs... on the wrong side, unfortunately. So they One yep. squad fairly easy to get in there on the right side of them. The Slavs pushing out. Rookie and... pushing the attack. Yep, they're in. Definitely they're in right now. <laughs> Gets bashed oh. to death. <laughs> Even without the bayonet. <laughs> nice guy. Nice guy up play. But still, Slavs. Yeah, and the Slavs are in the middle. Slavs are right. in. No way. Controlling the mid side of this trench. Probably they're going to get gunned down easily. Yep, yeah, there we go. That respawn was lucky for the Nordic. Yeah, game. really good to respawn there. And the Slavs can start over. Yes, now they have to set up the defenses pretty quickly. Also on the far left, because it's really, feels really empty there. Mm -hmm. No, they spread out pretty fairly, so they should be able to hold this for now. Pemo, Pemo's still going in No Man's Land. Going to the sniping spot, far left. Yeah. Back, and got a kill. He's playing really defensively, but it, it pays off. Yeah, it's really conservative. But at this point, uh, you need also your guys to to play well. Otherwise, it's useless uh, camping yeah. in the no man's land. Make sure that, that, that your team is pushing hard, because if you're only camping and getting the kills, you can't win trenches. Yes, it comes to mind Wanted Reflex this evening. Even though it's really conservative players, he just he was always in front of the trench. He was always in the in a good spot to pick people and at the same time to provide good spawns for this yeah, team. That's, that's important. Trench. But yeah, right now Pema still doing his job in the far left no one's yeah. land while the Slavs Slavs are kinda If three guys four But, uh, yep, outgunned and quite wide. Yeah. And the Nordic still controlling again. the entire trench. It's hard for them to push in. They're having yeah, a lot of time on this trench. Right now, it's not really important to take even that trench. It's important to only get the foothold. So, yeah, Nordic just... team can push them back and probably not going to take the trench again. At this yeah, point, like, the Slavs have the real advantage. The thing, yeah, like they just need to extend this attack as long as possible. Mm -hmm. The Nordic country capture it. Yeah, almost 15 seconds remaining for them. And then they're in the foothold. But, but, they, got, but they got in, so. Really good foothold right now. Kirbison, Kirbison leading the server. 27 kills and 16 there. I only need 10 more kills to get uh, the 90 seconds extra. 
at that. Yeah, that's true. Now it's just important of keeping the foothold. Nordic right now is going mad, I think. It's a bit playing, trying to play a lot more aggressive, but it's yeah. not the reward. Oh, Pemo got outplayed by himself. Did you say that? Perkele Vision pushing on the right side there. Yes. And Gets two kills, important kills. Yeah. And now the team almost the lost Slavs, the yeah. Slavs only one player in still. And they need to make sure they don't lose that one now. And yeah, big push, big push again for the Slavs. Uh, and unfortunately, they needed only three more kills for the 90 seconds. Yeah. They are spawned um, back in their own trench, unfortunately. Had oh. over the Norman yeah, a lot of deserters left. Yeah, they were but just all sprinting back to the trench to make sure they could keep continuing attacking. But yeah, now they keep pushing in a straight line, so they're keep guarding all the spots. But Slav Balkanistan really is credit to the left side, and Nordic team can really push hard in, in the left side to get them. There we go, they have a foothold, and now the crucial point, the corridor. Oh, Pemo hey. left? Oh no. Oh, Pemo. Oh, he's left. <laughs> no, he didn't left. <laughs> oh, almost Tim Webb, Tim Nordic, only Smiley Face alive. Uh, in... Oh, and meanwhile, Perkle oh. with his big push on the. while well, defending got most kills with 31 there. Yep, exactly. And the second description. Twenty Good job for him. Uh, right now, the Slavs are really, really spread out perfectly for the trench. Yep. They're fine perfectly. And then the Nordics having a hard time now, yeah. trying to get in the trench. But one is pushing. One is pushing, and this in it got him. Mad is in. Yeah, they can they can enter to that entrance yep. now and. Okay. Now oh, just point of watching corners really good. Rack job rack the spots. hill and they did a really good job to wipe the two guys who were pushing. And watch out on the flank. Uh, Kurbson, Kurbson took him, he made a party too with him after he got stabbed by the take Ime here up down like he stepped through another enemy to get to Ime. Just one of the other. Good While Slavo Balkanistan is desperately losing the trench yeah. right now. Big push by the Nordics and they got in actually. Yep. And now they can just mow down spawn after spawn. Zaros with a good odd flank here. But the vision going going bombs. trying hard, really hard right now. And he's getting rewarded by that. Yeah. He got a, a nice good kills on the finger. And uh, yep, right now Slavs need to push them back, but it's not really easy because uh, they hold only the fingers right now. They got in the heels, so that's important. They got in the heels, yep. And one of the Nordic team squads just spawned all the way back in their own trench, so they are at least running back for 20 seconds. They need to hurry up, yep, definitely. But I still got a nice foothold on the finger, the Nordic team. Yeah. Sure. I think Pemo is there. Am I right? Uh, yes, yeah, Pemo. Pemo, Pemo is, is in on... there. And Scrublet is on the further. Yeah. Only need seven more kills to get uh, the 90 extra seconds. That's six, six kills now. Uh, the way they are playing now, they should be able to get it. Yeah. Pushed out. They, have a nice, they have a really nice foothold right now on the right side. The one um, in. Yeah. Oh. Four missing for Red the extended push. time. Push. Uh, yep. Yeah. Oh, Pemo got outgunned by Gov. <laughs> oh, Gov going out and got the wall finger foothold. Oh, unfortunately. Yep. Stop, they even TV guy though. Yeah. What he gun gun down. They got the extra minute now, so. Yep. One minute. They can 
get a little bit of breathing time and start thinking of how to but, actually take the trench back. Definitely, but half of the Nordic team is still in their no man's land and not in the trench. While Slavs are pushing out from the corridor, also with a smart so flanking maneuver from the entire north. entire middle entrance open, so Bermo can get in there pretty easily with his squad. Yep. Oh. Get stuck in Bob Twilight first. Get stuck, uh, killed by Kurbson, yep. But Kurbson that's leading, right, right push. leading the slow by Kaniston team right now with 35 yeah. kills. Then Perkelev is with 44 on the other 44. side. Doing really, really good on the offensive here. As level Balkanistan is still spawning on that damned finger. They, so far they are not losing the trench, so they can be happy. Yes, they keep holding it. Oh no, right now they're only three alive. Two in the trench, and they kind of lose Pips it. on going for the risky flank that gets taken out, unfortunately. The Nordic all like stuck on one square meter. Yeah, so on they can't people, move actually. at this point. They keep getting pushed the by the uh, Slavs. Rook, you hit the Luger. <laughs> Get a few kills. Get a few kills, easy. It's important, only two more, three more players in the trench there. Oh, a nice outplay bomb by Raiden. Wiping Madis out. Oh! And they lost their momentum, unfortunately. Bash wasn't, wasn't working there for SKR. And yep. Nordic team crowded a bit on the left, and they're trying to spreading a bit out right yeah. now. Not pushing out enough, I guess. And then eventually losing it. Slavs are still holding and the advantage they had before in this match. And right now, try hard, really, on the left side. And yeah, they got their nice respawn. A wall squad is in there. Now they just well, need to make sure the well, the Nordic team got almost squad wiped, only one alive. The Nordics now just need to make sure that if they want to still win this game or make a draw out of it, like winning, they can't anymore. If they want to yeah. draw, they can't have any foothold. They yeah, the, at the this point, they can't have any foothold. They want to run out of time. They need to play really aggressive because time is running out fast. And uh, capping back the first and time trench is pretty difficult, considering that two fingers. Yeah, really big nomads and to cross over every time. So they know they've not, they can't win anymore. But now they they need to play for the draw. Because that one, those the one point you get can still be important for the next few games, play against Belgium or against France or anything, mm -hmm. for the overall ranking. Right now, Slobo Kanistan is pushing in a straight line towards yeah. No Man's Land. Trying to give an all time for the Nordic team. Their own trend, so they have to go run over entirely. Bemo again sitting at his trees, like halfway through. Yeah. On Trying to pick off those easy kills. Oh, he missed a ni nice easy kill, because uh, three guys on the slow Afghanistan really were up of the trench. Yeah, unfortunately oh, was just vision. moving around. Have a look, a triple kill by him, while keeping the corridor. Yeah. Oh, Rook is trying to spawn these guys. Yeah, he succeeded there. Yep, and the Slavo Afghanistan got a nice spawn on the left side, and now they're pushing guard. Well, Nordic so team back, uh, two, yeah, was three, in the corridor. Three Nordics there, just waiting for them. Berkele, yeah. Whoa, nice he play put by him. flank by him again. Double stab. 59 kills already for him. Next one in line is only 41. 41, Eight, yep. 18 more, yes, than Kripson. He's doing really, really well. Yes, right now Nordic team is really keeping a good spread. Yeah, make they they won't get momentum, so now they will just need to push. As and there we go. Now it's time. Now it's time to get the last trench. Yeah. 
Well, Slova Kenikas then got two deserters on the right side. Still deserting. No, but there is a missing one, unfortunately, behind him. Missing his shot. And gets oh, and stepped out, unfortunately. Then by Sars. Missed two important shots and gets eventually stepped. Mm. And yes. <laughs> Bemo outplaying himself with the anti <laughs> bomb. Second time. Second time in this match. <laughs> really, really unlucky. Yes, the Slavs have just have spread out pretty fine over the trends, so it will be it will the north Cyrus will by the time. But uh, he did a really great job uh, yep. holding the the ground. Time delaying the Nordics there. Now they only have like two and a half more minutes left to actually get in the trench. Oh, just not again. Can push, can push hard. Yeah. Well, Slavo Balkanistan forget about the left side of the trench. Same thing with we saw last attack. Like they kept on the left side, but then now if they learn the lesson. Will they push in the trench? They are doing yeah. a good job now. Doing good job. Also pushing five, hard five the players in the trench there. They have to hold the finger, considering it is a key point for this trench. Yeah. But they're moving pretty Back fast. again, though. pushing big, really hard on the, the trench. Vision forgot about the guy in the corner, and he gets he gets a spawn at a slough. Yep, and so Balkanistan got a yep. can got a really good spawn. Scripps and Scripps and Saros there, aiming over the trench. You know, they are yes. actually capturing it, they, have, they are almost completely captured, they Free will quarter control cap. out of it. Free quarter cap, and I think they're going to get it. They will get the trench. Yep, and... Really, really good job. Good job, Nordic team got... Oh, yep. Yes, eventually they got yes. it. Slavs just, just too late to the reinforcements there. Yeah, they, they were a bit unlucky with the respawn time. And now, no, the, you see, once they played aggressive, they got their draw out of it, so they can be happy. And yeah, remember so, it for so next game. So the vision changed during this match. He yeah. was starting playing a lot more conservative, but then he realized uh, he needed to hard carry his team, and he started to play really aggressive, and it got rewarded by that. Yeah, exactly. 65 kills. Contrary to last year, they can't just only rely on our personal skill. They need to work as a team. And 30 seconds remaining. Out. I think this match is over. It's a tie, yeah. and we have to look at the kills. One, one, two, two. We have to look at the kills, who, which are going to decide who is going to win this match. I think this will be more like lucky for downtown here. For the Nordics, because they have Pema and Perklevision. Exactly. 48 and 66 kills. Okay, it's over. Good job. Good, good job. game. Yeah, very good game. They Mind had a nice recap at the end. Nordic Ball team. Ball and Ball right now they, they have to hope that the score is going to, to be in their favor. Okay. Did you make the screenshot? Yes. Okay, cool. I'm just looking it up to see where the fuck it is stored on my PC. Your screenshots, yes. Eighteen, fifteen, no. Hmm. 